Hey everyone, it's Coach LB. It's day 49 and today we are looking at Romanian deadlifts or RDLs. This is another hip hinge movement and contrary to what some people like to believe, this movement actually starts at the top. It's just like a squat in the sense that it starts at the top and works its way down. One of the biggest mistakes I've seen and one of the biggest things you need to make sure you do is that when you're doing any deadlift, you are pulling your shoulders back and down. You really want to engage those lats when you're doing any kind of deadlift movement. Now this is sometimes confused with a stiff leg deadlift, but this one you actually do bend your knees. You are taking that weight down and you are lowering it to just below your knees and then coming back up. This is a hip hinge. You can do this with a single kettlebell or dual kettlebells, dumbbells. When you're using two, you can use a standard positioning like you do with a single dumbbell or kettlebell, or you can use what is called a suitcase st style of lift, where it's gonna be out at your sides. If you were doing a single kettlebell suitcase care, uh, deadlift, you would use that same suitcase style hold. The biggest thing with deadlifts is not to get these confused with the stiff leg deadlift. The stiff leg deadlift, you do keep your knees very locked out as you go down and hinge at your hips. But this one you don't. Uh, we used to use the cue, shave your thighs with the bar to teach people how to do this movement. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this. I hope you got something out of this video. I hope you learned the difference between a Romanian deadlift, stiff leg deadlift, and I will catch you in the next video. Peace.